What's up guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video and guys today we're going to go over the top three ways on how to make MT right now in NBA 2K21 My Team. And yes guys, pretty, pretty, pretty solid, solid, solid way to make MT. We're going to go over the top three ways. Before we get into it, 100 likes. Please, let's get 100 likes on this video man. Be greatly appreciated. Sub it up. We're on the road to 13,000 subs man. It's been a grind. We gained 12,000 subs in NBA 2K20. So let's keep it going, man. Twitter, Twitch. We're going to stream today on YouTube and all that good stuff. So let's go over it, man. Let's go over how to make MT fast. So we're going to start off with Triple Threat Online. This is going to be one of your best ways to make Triple Threat on To be good at the game, to get better at the game. And as you guys can see, my first two losses in the whole game were on TTO. It's very hard. Right now, man, I suggest you run the big man lineup. I was running Ben Simmons, De uh, Giannis, and De DeMarcus Cousins. But I did snipe out Giannis. And we're going to get on the second way to make MT in the game. For 29 k and he's selling for 57000 MT. If you guys have any Amethyst 20 cards, I would probably recommend you guys sell them right this second. So, blah, blah, Triple Threat Online, man, is going to be your best way to bank your MT right now online modes wise so if you're playing online you're gonna get a ton of tokens you're gonna get a ton of tokens ton of MT. not only that you're gonna get terrell brandon though these games are like five to ten minutes long you should be able to make at least a decent amount of MT with this method man just grind tto if you're not good at tto we're gonna go over three other ways you can bank your MT. and while doing these tto games you could also try to do these season agendas which also make your level go up. If you guys don't know what level is, man, these are all the awards. To get your level up, man, season agendas. This is also a great way to make MT. A great way to get a pink diamond, a free pink diamond. And so while you're doing that, you could do some of these. Some I done are tip off Bibby, Jeff T, some of these new cards and whatnot, man. You get a lot of MT and whatnot from these cards. It's a very good way to make MT right now. Also a very good way to make tokens and whatnot. So definitely try TTO online. We're going to get into the next method, man. And it's sniping. It's auction flipping. It's investing. And it all comes from the auction block. And if you guys don't know what this is, a simple answer is just listen to me, man. I drop MT methods on this channel every single day. So my best snipe of the year is by far Giannis Antetokounmpo. I'm going to make around 25,000 MT off this card. Now... Here's how it works. Here's how investing works in this game. It's simple. First off, if you invested in any Amethyst cards yesterday, they are up so much MT. So if I were you, I would probably recommend selling your cards right now. Um, any Amethyst cards you have, sell them. Because if you think about it, if you continue to grind online, offline, you're going to get a bunch of free cards. Not only that, I'm running with Sapphires, man. It's fine. You could just run with Sapphires also from the token reward market in which if you've been grinding domination and challenges and whatnot, you're most likely up to where I'm at. So that's probably one of your best methods. Definitely start off with domination and or TTO. It gets you better at the game, triple threat online. Another way to make a lot of MT is triple threat offline, man. If you guys don't know, Denver Struck already has the 200 win guy, Stefan Marbury. As you play TTO offline, you get about 500 MT per win. So if you get 200 MT, you're going to get 100k MT for about 20 hours of playing minimum. That's not counting any of this stuff right here. So you're talking about 500 MT. So 100k MT plus all these packs. You could possibly get Giannis from the pack. You could possibly get a sick Amethyst from these packs, man. There's a lot going on. Amethyst Isaiah Ryder is another card that's amazing. So Triple Threat Offline, definitely a great way to make MT. Triple Threat Off Online, definitely a great way to make MT. Not only are you going to get better at the game... You get to see how people play online. All I'm saying, with Triple Threat Online, you have to be decent at the game. As you can see, I'm 1 and 2, man. My first two games ever on 2K were a little tough, but my third win came off. My third win, my third game was a win. It is a little hard. You have to run the big man lineup. I ran two point guards, the worst move ever. I did not know everybody runs big mans cuz it's hard to shoot in this game. So yeah. 
pretty much true with their online. Now, let's get into sniping, man. If you guys don't know, sniping right now is definitely dry as hell. Right now, if you make MT, it's mostly off investments. How are you going to make MT off investments? How do you invest? You simply just follow me and watch my videos every single day. As you can see, I already about to have 300,000 MT, and that's literally from grinding the market. I did spend about 300,000 VC on packs, but realistically, I only probably got around 60,000 MT from those packs. And now we are up about 200,000 MT. And not only that, I also sold 100,000 to one of my friends in MT. So I really have 400,000 MT plus my team. I made about 300,000 off sniping and whatnot in the last couple of days off investments and whatnot. So definitely a lot going on right now. Also, every single card you get in your collection. If you let's say you have your set team every single extra card get rid of them while you can because if you think about it these sets are not worth it yet man the collector level in this game is just not good the collector level in this game is trash 2,000 cards for Lillard 4,000 cards for Tatum and only freaking 500 cards 35 tokens guys this is not worth it whatsoever guys if you are going for a collector level you gotta be crazy it's not worth it but here are you gonna how are you gonna make MT easily fast well sapphire method ruby method is going to be your best methods right now you just got to know pricing if you guys want go check out some pricing just go over pricing go over each card one by one by one by me i know pricing already so i know every single price pretty much man you just got to look for what's going up what's going down right now man market is definitely rising a big time that's a snipe and we missed it that was Charles Lewis is pretty expensive. We could have made about 3,000 MT profit right there. So rubies, they're all... Oh, uh, I wasn't gone. This one, is that a snipe? Probably not. But pretty much all you have to do is raise your maximum buyout and just continue to refresh, man. You don't even have to move your maximum buyout. You could just press B and start. Just then again, man, there is some lag. Like this Rashad Lewis was like a 3,000 MT snipe. If you stay on the ruby filter you're most likely gonna make lots of mt you just gotta be patient gotta see what's going on in the waters i think that Kyrie might be a snipe i'm not totally sure though you just gotta continue i'm gonna buy that uh, yeah it was a snipe so you just gotta continue to refresh oh right there 2800 Jokic. we missed that one too we could have made a solid 200 mt quick missed that auction is a little laggy i would definitely start off with the rubies and the sapphires to make faster quicker mt but yeah, man, the market's definitely slower today. This is going to be your best way to make MT, sniping off the Ruby and Sapphire. If you have more MT, probably Amethyst or Diamond. It's just not a lot of snipes are going to pop up per hour. The game's slow. Not a lot of people are playing my team. A lot of people usually start off in my career when NBA 2K21 drops. But my team is definitely, definitely, if you can get your MT up now, man, in a couple months, if you don't play a lot, Try to get your MT up now. In a couple months, you get a, a God Squad for like 100,000 MT. So definitely try out this. So pretty much overall, the top three methods in NBA 2K21, my team right now, to make MT is definitely the auction house. Ooh. Wow. We missed that one too. Definitely the auction house. Definitely triple threat offline, online, and all that good stuff, man. That's going to be your best ways to make MT hands down right now. Triple threat online, offline. And if you guys want... Limited is not a bad idea either. But other than that, that's really it. Top three is how to make MT, how to make millions of MT. This is the way. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Third video coming soon. This is the second of today. And yeah, guys, hope you did enjoy. Have a good one. Peace.